This is David Danyo Jr., your friend and farmer from Philippines, a member of the Global Farmer Network. We are happy to sh uh, share you and show you the activities and production we have here in our area. We are producing corn, hot paper, and rice we, and other crops. And we are happy to show you our activities in our farm. I hope that you will enjoy learning and watching our videos. Good luck and happy farming. Hello. Welcome to Take Pop-Up, the smart learner channel We educate intelligent farmers and provide effective solutions to your problems. Gumagamit po ba kayo ng maraming inorganic fertilizer? Asidik din po ba ang inyong lupain? Mabagal bang lumaki ang inyong mga halaman? Panahon na po para pagandahin at pababain yung paggamit ng inorganic fertilizer. Kayo po na nag-organic, pwede po ninyong gamitin ito. Kayo po na natatakot sa mga insecticide, natatakot sa mga uh, iba't iba pang mga chemical na inilalagay sa halaman, pwede po sa inyo ito. Tayo po ay gumagamit ng probiotics o itong lactobacillus lactic acid. Ito po ay nagpapaganda o binabalik niya yung ganda ng lupa. Binubulok po niya ng madalas o mabilis yung mga pwedeng bulokin sa lupa kagaya ng mga dahon, yung mga rice straw, kung ano pang mga pwedeng uh, maging uh, pataba sa inyong lupa, pinapabilis po nito ang pagbubulok. At ang ginagawa po niya ay yung mga binubulok po ay ginagawa po niyang amino acid na yung amino acid ay uh, nagtataglay ng nitrogen at ang nitrogen ay nagpapaganda sa ating halaman para ito'y mabilis lumaki at magaganda, malalaki po ang bunga so subukan po ninyo itong ating probiotics itong ating 3K fertilizer at para gumanda ang inyong halaman at may balik yung dating matabang lupa it is 8 o'clock in the evening and we are heading towards our hot paper we are going to spray insecticide today because the leaves of our hot paper is getting curly there are white flies and other insects that affects it so the, the leaves turn curly and we are passing through between our uh, corn our this is our corn and this is the corn of our neighbor the corn of our neighbor is although is also more than seven feet there are cubs already so you can see there are two cubs coming out so this is our corn and it's about seven feet tall but not yet uh, flowering the tassel may be coming out uh, in, in a week or next week the tassel will be coming out while uh, the, the height of our corn compared to the height of uh, this uh, corn of our neighbor uh, are almost the same but the corn of our neighbor has already uh, flower or tassel we're going to walk uh, another few meters towards our drum where the water contain. We're going to get water there to be used in our uh, mixture of water and insecticide used to eradicate, uh, kill those insects that affects our hot paper. So here is our hot paper. So you can see that uh, what we have explained in our be, uh, other videos that we spray uh, insecticide during night and also with our corn so look at our corn it's about seven feet tall more than seven feet tall but not yet flowering and uh, in the previous uh, we have sprayed it uh, with uh, insecticide during night uh, we spray insecticide during night because during this time the insects was there they are uh, 
uh, eating, they are uh, they are not wandering. Not unlike during the day, if you spray insecticide, your target are not there. So sometimes when they go home, the insecticide was, uh, was already uh, evaporated. No, the the only left was the smell and sometimes other insects will not be affected so this time uh, i see to it that they are at home they are there in the uh, in the plants eating and maybe uh, sleeping or resting so until tomorrow they will they will be there so now i will, I will going to target them by spraying them insecticide <laughs> So we're going to show you how we mix insecticide to our sprayer tank. Okay, so here is our drum, plastic drum. This drum contains 200 liters. So if you need a lot of water and a lot of uh, maybe uh, 10 to 11, 10 to 12 loads of sprayer, you can use this one. You can mix uh, the foliar, the insecticide in this drum. So you, you, you will going to uh, use it uh, uh, use it wisely because uh, this drum contains 200 liters and 16 uh, 16 liters container divided by 200 liters about uh, 12, 12, uh, 12 16 liters i think so if you going to uh, mix it at once no? uh, this will avoid the over dosage this will avoid the uh, the lacking of dosage no? because uh, the the 100 ml silhouette is exactly good for one drum, good for 200 liters of water. The 500 grams of power grower, 500 grams of heavyweight, and also the half of the 250 ml of ana is exactly good for 200 liters. So our first thing to do is to so if you uh, if you put it here, no, you just stir it thoroughly so that it will be mixed then if you cannot use it uh, all then you can cover this one with plastic cover this one with plastic then you can uh, reuse it again uh, the other day but do not allow uh, five days uh, before using it because the uh, the strength or the validity of the mixture will be expiring so it's good that if you mix it use it two to three days okay so we're going to put water to the container first before adding the uh, insecticide and foliar to the mix used to spray my hot paper with curly leaves okay so it has no water inside it's not and we're going to fill maybe one third one third yeah. okay pouring the clean water coming coming from the drum and we'll have it again another maybe it, it it's more the um, maybe this one is uh, six, six liters the first one that we're going to put is the 3k fertilizer of course i always use 3k fertilizer when i spray because aside from making our plants uh, good and beautiful uh, grow faster the 3k fertilizer improves the soil so i usually put uh, this one contain 3.5 uh, uh, this is 35 to 40 ml so I'm going to put three of this. One, two, three. 
three. Not full because if, 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 if I full, I, 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 I make it full, some will spill and it would be uh, next I will go into at this heavyweight tandem so make sure that this level scoop one I, I will put four level scoop two three four then uh, next that I'll going to put I'll also put some libitol Uh, this is not normal in my spraying activity, but uh, today let's experiment uh, mixing it, adding BB to our sprayer. So you could still see the bottles, empty bottles of tricky fertilizer that I already used up in my spraying activity. Next, we're going to put some anaa. This is very important because this is a growth hormone. Uh, it's, uh, the uh, contents is about 15 ml, 15 to 20 ml. But the recommended rate is only 10 ml. But it's good to use more than that recommended uh, rate. So this one, I'm going to add Milan. This one is for hoppers. Uh, Milan uh, is available in the market, but sometimes you cannot see it. This is hoppers. Uh, 1.5 to 2 is good for 16 liters. So this is about uh, 10, more than 10. More than 10 only because I'm going to add Pegasus. Yeah, this one. Pegasus is uh, an expert also of this what they call white fly and the curly leaves of the hot paper okay more than 10 ml because i have already this milan then the next to be mix will be uh before i forget i will put this uh silhouette first Silhouette will be. Uh, we will put uh, maybe five to seven ml of silhouette. Okay. Okay. So we'll pour it. Silhouette is uh, essential because it is a sticker. It prolongs the effect of the insecticide in foliar. In case that it will rain, uh, you're not going to have that thinking that it will be washed away by rain because silhouette is a sticker that will prolong the effect of the insecticide in case it rains. Then you also have some Delta King because you will going to add Nembesidine. This is for the insects. Yeah, 10 ml only. That's enough. And now we'll put nembesidine. This is an organic fertilized, um, organic insecticide. Okay. The one that I'm showing you and using is the old, old my old old stock of nembesidin what i'm selling now is is the, the the new new the new so whenever i have old stock i don't sell it i use it so about 20 ml of nembesidin will be mixed or added to the mixture okay 
and I will also add so maybe you are wondering why there are so many mixtures or additives that I am uh, pouring uh, will it not affect the effect of the, the tricky fertilizer since some the tricky fertilizer is like a living organism tricky fertilizer will only not be uh, used if you're using water with chlorine so this is malatayon i am pouring 20 ml malatayon is used to eradicate the uh, ants because there are some ants in our uh, hot paper so this one is not uh, the highly recommended but I am using it to study the effect on my uh, hot paper so that if ever the effect is good if ever the effect is excellent then I can I, I can recommend it to viewers or to some uh, followers who are asking the best uh, solution for curly uh, leaves of hot paper or any other uh, vegetables that could be uh, uh, applied with this uh, kind of solution so the the the, the heavyweight and them is used to is uh, a potassium solution uh, concentrate it has 40% uh, uh, potassium and 40% uh, potassium is needed by the plant to grow a nice or bigger fruits especially heavier fruits I have observed in my corn that in whenever I use that heavyweight tandem my corn weight is different they are heavy same with the uh, the rice plant and every other uh, any other uh, crop that i use heavyweight on them so good they obtain heavier uh, weight the string beans become heavier the okra become heavier and uh, they have nice uh, uh, flowering and fruiting so I will close this one so uh, uh, nearly full so I don't make it full because it will spill as I will going to carry it so I'll show you how I, I apply this to my hot paper so to those uh, followers subscribers who are maybe wondering why I use this English uh, language to explain my video it is because uh, there are requests especially farmers from other country who would like to learn from our videos they are requesting English language to be used in our videos so now uh, we're going to uh, we're going to respect their uh, requests so that's why I prepare this uh, English video to answer their inquiries and for them to understand what I'm telling so these are my these are my uh, hot paper we'll, we'll start here but actually we're going to apply this mixture there because I have already finished spraying this one but for the record for just for just to show you I'm going to start here So we have already started our sprayer. This battery operated sprayer is very nice. It's a, it has controller that you can make it uh, uh, strong and slow. So we are controlling it to make it slow. So here I'm showing you how we spray this one. Uh, only uh, small, not strong, but it's slow. So this is some something like uh, the fad pad it's good to uh, mix this with pinak bed or what you call this the eggplant the sweet potato so here is how we spray it this is how we apply so 
So we'll, we'll add the, the, the uh, we'll add the the pressure so that it will uh, blow faster. Okay. So so this is better. So this is how we uh, apply the mixture, the mixture that we have shown you a while ago. So I, I have already mentioned why we are spraying during night because the N6 is here. It, uh, sometimes we call this massacre because the N6 are resting their home so that's why it's the proper time for them to be killed or to be sprayed yeah some are there especially the butterfly are flying they are already uh, touched by the sprayer the the milan will kill them because every hoppers that will be touched by that milan maybe will be killed So this is how we do it. I hope you learned something from this video. And keep coming back because we will going to show you more. Oh. Uh, I thought it's the 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 butterfly that falls. It's the petals of the hot paper that falls. I suppose that it is the butterfly. The uh, the ground is still wet, so we come to the end, and we're going to spray this one. Uh, this the mixture that we have prepared is also good for this uh, eggplant. So we're going to spray this eggplant. No, uh, starting here, going to right direction or left direction I should say our eggplant is about to they are already bearing flower <laughs> I am waiting for the fruit to come out but unfortunately they are attacked by insects the mixture of nimbacidin is and delta king is good for this one the uh, 3k will improve the growth the 3k and the ana uh, with the bb tall will improve the growth of this eggplant it will uh, have more branches and if there's more branches there are more fruits and flowers to, to come out We sprayed uh, applying mist only. We do not allow the spray solution to drip. Mist only. As long as it is uh, blank, uh, the, the leaves catches the mist, that's enough. Anyway, this, this spray solution has silhouette that would make the solution stay for longer period. There are shoot bore. I can see some shoot that are that, that, that dried because it was affected by shoot bore. And let us see if the Nembesidin and Delta King can help. So if you have comments, if you have a uh, question, if you have suggestion, it's also welcome here in our channel. We are all, we are ready to learn, we are ready to accept whatever suggestion you have as long as it will help. Okay, now the next is the hot paper. This is one is the they called it uh, ceiling panigang mix <laughs> and the, the, the uh, you can see uh, I cannot 
to make the camera nearer to the plant because it is hanging in my neck but I can see curly leaves coming out so that's why the solution is for this plant to improve the quality of leaves the improve the quality of the flower and at the same time improve the quality of the fruit so until next video i hope that you will uh, keep coming back to learn more so that if you will make this as a source of your income you will earn more bye bye